that um, it's, I guess, just a comfort thing. I really like them, so I like having them around. Why owls? Because they have really big eyes. In my whole life, I've been told I have really big eyes, so I feel like I'm basically an owl. <laughs> I thought everyone was going to be mean, like just stare you down when you're when like you're looking at them, but it's not the case. A lot of people look at you and smile when you're walking around campus. I was definitely the most nervous about making friends and making new experiences, and also of course classes, because everyone says that college classes are so much more hard than high school. I didn't know anybody here. I didn't have any friends, and I was just kind of nervous to live next to people that I never knew before or knew how to live next to. I have. More owl pillows. <laughs> owl blanket. I definitely was scared of having a roommate that I wouldn't get along with or who wouldn't like me because I'm definitely hard to live with sometimes. I was excited to take the next step in my life. I knew what I wanted to do going in. I knew I wanted to be an occupational therapist. I knew this was the next step. It feels like a community really, even outside your res hall. If I didn't live on campus, I definitely would have missed out a lot on meeting people in the community that really is Eastern. I have a community and a family here. I have a whole bunch of friends who I just love and cherish. Move-in day was actually much easier than I thought it would be. The move-in day was crazy. All the CAs and like housing staff have like carts and they'll all like help you bring your stuff up. So we pulled up to the back, unloaded it. I had like three carts. But it was really great, and my mom, like even like afterwards, spoke to our RLC Katie Bell, and she was like, "Wow, this is like the best moon day ever." And then I always like the line was supposed to go a specific way. I started at the end of the line somehow. I just didn't understand what happened. Now is my spirit animal. Advice to incoming freshmen would be: uh, Don't be afraid to talk to new people. Everybody wants to make friends, just like you. Get out of your comfort zone and meet as many people as you can in your res hall. Creating a community within your building is very important, I think, and I think that's the most exciting part about being a freshman. You make Eastern your home and join a community on campus because you're living with people you've never met before learning from people you never met before, and just trying something new. All of the CAs I've become really close to, and that's been fun, and it's been fun to have kind of a support system through them. Just be understanding, because no one has been raised the same way you have been. So their habits and their hygiene and just the way they live is going to be slightly different. Don't leave your laundry in the washer or dryer machines longer than 15 minutes, because people do get mad. I made like my closest friends through that first week, just like we were going to the same activities and we just started talking and we haven't stopped talking since. My roommate's spirit animal is a sloth because she sleeps all day. 